Welcome to Ask Davis Golf. I'm here today joined by Andy Jones, one of the professionals I coach who plays in the EuroPro Tour. And we're going to walk you through and talk you through a putting drill that I like my players to do. I have to give credit to this drill to Dave Aldrich because it's one I picked up from him. But it's a great drill to help you discover whether you're better at right to left putts, left to right putts, or certain ranges in putts from 3 foot to 12 foot. It's a great drill to give you a benchmark to your score and then from there pick out strengths and weaknesses. One, to use your strengths to hit your your pro shots into and pitch shots into, but also to get your weaknesses to practice to help develop your scores better for the future. So how the drill works is we set tee pegs up from 3 all the way to 12 foot, every tee peg a foot apart, so 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, in four directions. Ideally one would be downhill left to right, uphill right to left, downhill right to left, and obviously uphill left to right. So it gives you the idea of four different types of breaking putts, all from di different distances. What you do, you have a notebook, if you hold out from 3 foot you'd have a tick, if you miss from 3 foot it'd be cross then tick. So we'll show some video of Andy hitting these putts and we'll give you an idea of how that kind of scoring works. And then we'll want to know is how many putts it takes you to putt all the putts from one particular direction. For example, if you hold every putt in the first attempt, it would be 10 putts. If you miss two, it would be 12 putts, and then so on. So the idea is then you can break that down to whether you're eight foot right to left putts, are you most successful or your least successful? And then that would be one to practice more. But also the most successful area you'd, you'd hit from, or you putt from, that's where we try and focus to hit our pitch shots and chip shots and even the pro shots into. So if we knew the green was right to left in a certain section of the green, we might purposely try and hit our second shot or pro shots in there to leave ourselves our most gainable chance of holding the putt. Also recommend using shots to hold to sort of back up all this kind of data which will show you how you can compare to tournament play from this practice drill. Have a go at it and see how you get on. Make sure you keep a record of your results and use that as a benchmark and also use that for success, for confidence, growth and building.